Hello my earth signs, welcome back to my channel, Presence of a Goddess. Thank you guys for joining me today. Today is just going to be a general message, so if it resonates, awesome. If it doesn't, you can check your sun, moon, and rising. And if you want to book a personal reading with me, the link is down below. Alright, to my Capricorn, Taurus, and my Virgos, we're going to get started with my moon analogy card. I don't know why this wanted to come out so bad. Your hard work is paying off, earth signs. You could be a Capricorn or you could have um, Capricorn in your charts. All right. Everybody's getting conclusions are within reach. Every sign. Okay. The end of a tough cycle approaches. You definitely could be a uh, Capricorn. Like, that's period. <laughs> they want me to do one more. Okay, I got to look at the bigger picture and the energy is gaining momentum. You could have Sagittarius in your chart. Um, but I, I'm getting you could be heavily a Capricorn that's watching this or have Capricorn in your chart. But for my earth signs, I'm getting that you are in a tough cycle after um, pushing through, working through it, um, having hope, having faith. Um, you've been through a lot. Some of you guys probably were financially struggling. Some of you guys are probably were mentally struggling, spiritually struggling. Whatever you were struggling with is different for each viewer. But I am getting that you were struggling with something and that is coming to an end. Like a tough cycle is coming to it. Like you learned a lesson. Like you have, um, you're coming into like a shift, like a new moon. It could have been a current new moon, new moon in cancer that it could have shifted. And now everything is coming to fruition for you. Yeah, the emperor. Again, somebody could have gotten a new job. Somebody could have got a higher position. Um, somebody could be a manager. Somebody could be like a boss. Somebody has Taurus in their chart. Yes, it had two of cups. It's going to bring in alignment with yourself. Somebody could be um, in a tough cycle in a relationship and it's coming to an end. But I feel like this is you. Like this is personal. Like that's what I'm hearing. This shit is personal. Don't you take it personal, but this is personal. So with the Two of Cups, you could have water in your chart. But I'm also feeling like there's a lot of emotions um, of you waiting on something. And now it's coming into fruition. Um, the lily pads are jumping out to me. So it's like you took a leap of faith at something. You went for it, even though you believed. I got you believed in an impossible. Yeah, like the magician. This is something you could have been manifesting. And you never thought it could happen to you. But spirits is saying like your hard work is paying off. Like you stood in your truth, and this is the reward you're getting. Um, you could be manifesting during the new moon, like you doing your thing, like you're manifesting on a daily basis. Like you're just you're believing in yourself. You coming in alignment with the universe. They're hearing your um, they're hearing you and they're believing you. They see you doing the work, and that's why everything is coming. Um, that's why the cycle of a tough cycle is ending because you learned that. You learned that you have to come into the alignment with universe in the most high um, in order for things to come alive, for your reality to come to what you wanted. Because you know, you're realizing you're the co-creator um, of your reality. Like for things to be to make happen, you have to speak it into existence. You have to think it into existence. You have to do it into existence. You know what I'm saying? But the Empress, this is definitely attracting things that you have been manifesting. This is you, like with a wand. You're like, ta-da, and it happens. Like, that's the energy I'm getting. Some of you guys could be Afro-Latina. Some of you guys could be uh, just African-American. I don't even like that word. Um <laughs> Because uh, you could be an aboriginal. Um, some of you guys could be visiting the lake. Some of you guys probably love mushrooms. I'm not, I don't know. The, look at the spiritual symbolism of mushroom. I don't know why I want to say that. But this is her wine. You're manifesting. You're attracting everything that you've been asking the universe for. Like, look at this. She's holding her wine in here. She's holding her wine right here. Like, this is, this is like everything you get. Everything you ask for is like, it's yours. It's like a magnet. You're attracting it's like because a lot of things in your past, you just I feel like you had to open up your eyes and release those emotions. I feel like maybe in the past you regretted things that you have done. But now you're coming to terms like this is not the way to go about in my life. Um, you found out there, there are conclusions that are within reach. And you decided to move forward in confidence. It's like me me crying in my, my sorrow is not going to do anything. 444 four, four. like that's you're coming into happiness you're coming to re realization that you create your own happiness that no one can do it for you so with the five i feel like that's change you had to change your mindset 
um, some, somebody could have um, broken up with someone or somebody you could have got broken up with um, and it broke your heart and you're like, I thought this person was the one, but now you're finding somebody who's actually the one that wants to be with you and wants to be dominant in your life. That's not for everybody. Like I said, the situation is different, but with the three of cups, I also do feel like um, you're going to be celebrating a new chapter in your life with your soul tribe. These are people that have been supporting you and pushing you forward, helping you push forward. Um, you could have like-minded people in your circle that also manifest. And this is what helped you, motivated you to manifest because the chariot is motivation as well. So I feel like they push you to do better and to be better because that's their that's They inspired you. With the Ace of Cups, this is your new chapter of, of um, love. Somebody, like I said, could be starting a new relationship, and this is full of love and genuine. But if you're not in a relationship, this is definitely a chapter of just um, a new start. This is from a new beginning of happiness that's about to happen to you. Like I told you, it's 444. This is a new beginning of you getting out of your head. Some of you guys, I feel like you're sitting there, you're like, oh. You could have air water in your chart because this is a similar I feel like everybody's in this situation where they feel like, can this happen to me? Like, you're stressing yourself out. You could be just coming out of this, though. Like I said, with the Five of Cups, you're starting to realize you cannot keep stressing about something that you're not changing. So you realize that you sitting there stressing is not going to do anything. You're using, you're using your brain power to, like... I feel like you're changing your mindset. You see these worms is dead. It's a different type of mindset now. And with the Eight of Pentacles, this is definitely you. So like I said, somebody could have got out of heart promotion. Like they could have uh, filled out for a uh, position that they thought they could never be qualified for. And they are being qualified for. Um, but if it's not a job, it's just something like that you thought you could never be. Like you didn't have the, um, the resume or the type of... Uh, skills but you do it don't even just have to be about a job take it as an apply but i'm definitely getting heavy jobs for most of you guys and you but also this is a card of focus they want me to say you've been you've been staying focused and you, yeah that's what i'm getting you stay focused you this is your hard work is paid off definitely could definitely be uh rising up grinding i feel like some people probably try to project their negativity on you. So I say, you can't do that. And that You never did that before. But spirits is like, so what? You know, they bless you with a position. They bless you with whatever this gift was because you did the hard work to work towards it. But I do feel like it's for somebody who was in love and then it's a job. Take it as a resonate. Um, if there's none of these, you might want to check out your other signs because this is definitely a job. Somebody is rising up in their position as in their job. Um... Yep, boss status, you're getting higher pay um, for love. I feel like somebody is going to be with this person long term and they are going to take care of you. So, yeah, somebody could have been financially struggling. The end of a cycle of financially struggling, you're coming out of that. And I feel like you've been working hard. And now you're about to boss up. You're about to get the money you deserve. Yeah, but the seven of wands, like, protect your energy because there's haters out there who don't want to see you win. Okay, because they're going to be looking at you like, how she get that? How did he get that? You know, how they getting that? How, you know what I'm saying? Just hating. And it's like, don't worry about it. Most high got me. You know, but little do they know you've been working the backgrounds, manifesting this like a dog, been staying on the grind despite all your obstacles. You still kept moving forward. And little do they know, like I told you, but you went at the end with the night of wands. This is victory after feeling beaten down, after you've been beaten down by life. This is you winning at the end. You stood up and you, you fought for this. Like, this is you fought, got beat up a little bit, and you still won. Period. I'm getting boxing. <laughs> like, I'm, you know, some Mike Tyson type thing. You got beat up, but you still won. And this was divine. This is divine timing for you. Even though you thought this, you had to wait a long time, this was meant to happen because you had to learn some life lessons along the way. But at the end of the day, this is divine. This is was um, orchestrated for this to happen for you to get this position or get this love that is true divine. You are with a soulmate if you're in a relationship. Okay. So no longer being in your head because what I'm saying is true. So your hard work is paying off. This is the end of a tough cycle. So you need to celebrate your new chapter in your life, my little manifester. 
Okay, Earth signs, I hope this resonates. If it did, support you guys, subscribe, and share it to those who may need to hear this. Uh, until next time.